Hello ladies and gentlemen, Holotide here, and before we get started into this video, I just want to say thank you to every single one of you who has supported this channel. I mean, I think I started it in 2015, and we've gone through multiple iterations of what the channel is, and I really just want to say thank you. Uh, we hit 10,000 subscribers, and that has been my goal for, you know, forever. That's been what I wanted to hit, and uh, it was a goal that I had with one of my best friends who also made uh, YouTube content, and unfortunately he passed away a couple years ago. So I just want you guys and gals to know that it means a lot to me that we hit that milestone. Does that mean we're stopping? Absolutely not. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the, it's not so much vague, but the tweet that Sketch had made in reply to one of the community members, Patman Gaming, about communication. So Sketch said, we're about to emerge from this cocoon, putting together an update for next week to go over what to expect over the next several months. Once we're fully into regular seasonal development cadence, we'll have more to regularly show and tell. So something that I've been thinking about is, man, we haven't heard anything about co-op and stuff like that. So I don't think co-op is going to land in August, but I think that it'll probably launch with Forge. So this is what I'm expecting from this I guess, blog post or whatever it's going to end up being. Co-op and Forge date announcement. They can no longer, you know, keep the date close to their, their chest, I guess. We are a couple of days away from September. And while I know, you know, dates are, you know, they targeted dates can move. I understand that. But we have to be at to the point where they're, they're starting to make promises. The next thing that I expect is for the next event to be announced. And that is the yapping that takes place in September. If you don't know what the yapping is, I will leave a link in the description and in the comments. Uh, it's a video that I made a couple months ago talking about the yapping rewards and whatnot. And it's supposed to be a more lighthearted, wacky, fun time. As opposed to, I guess, like, you know, the Last Barn Standing or Laying Grab game modes. This one's more of fun game modes. The next, I guess, issue I think that they should talk about is everything in reference to leaks. They should clear up, you know, what is happening for the immediate future that includes like you know weapons maps modes equipment i understand that you don't want to just show everything and you want to have surprises and a big reveal but so much has already been leaked and some of it is stuff from like halo 5 and it looks like it's just leftover content that I think getting out in front of those people and telling them, you know, it's like, yeah, that the Prometheans, they're not in Halo Infinite. It's not something we plan on doing. But like the DMR, the bandit rifle, yes, it's pretty much done. We plan to release it ASAP. But really, that's what I think the blog post is really going to go over. Because in the original tweet, he said, curious, what's your preferred means of getting new info? And official reveals are always faster, but not always accurate, which means, you know, some things have been, I guess, incorrectly reported. Leaks can sometimes really suck for people doing the work on the inside. I agree with that. Are game leaks different than TV movie book spoilers? Blah, 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 blah. So obviously I voted leaks because I'm chaotic. But that's what I think they're going to do. They're, they're really going to try to clear up a lot of this stuff. And a lot of the things that has you know, been leaking, even like the vehicles and stuff, is that this is content that they are working on. There are things being updated in however the leakers find the, the data mining files and all that cool stuff. Like, stuff is happening. What I would really like to see is them allude to Season 3 as well, what we can expect. Is it gonna be a three-month season? I know a lot of people are talking about, you know, don't, don't get your hopes up, you know, it's just, you know, you're gonna be let down and stuff, but truly... I cannot lie to you all, if this is not a substantial info blast update, I'm going to be very worried. But that's going to do it for the video, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed it, leave a like as it helps the channel. If you're new, subscribe, and I will catch you around the ring. Peace!